degrees colder than yesterday's numbers. And there you see the difference. There's a pretty sharp line there where the cloud cover is held on in the west and north zone. A lot of the metro and south zone has seen a decent amount of sunshine today. But tomorrow, all of us should be seeing it as high pressure is a little bit more firmly in control. On Thursday, it could get a patch of clouds roll through here, but we're still going to remain dry through the work week. That front that sweeps through on Friday, it's going to keep all the moisture north of us, so it's going to pass through dry. But this front, as we get into the weekend, will bring some rain. And you can see it's a warm front, so there may be some showers ahead of it as we get into the afternoon. But most of the rain is going to be behind the front in the late evening and overnight hours. And that's going to last into Sunday, finally wrapping up towards the end of the day. But as we get into next week, there's going to be another sort of wave roll through there. And look at that. That's all blue. It's lake enhanced or lake effect at that point. So it could be seeing some flakes around as we get into the start of next week. But you saw that warm front coming through. There's just a small chance uh, out at the big house on Saturday that we could see some rain at the end of that game. Otherwise, in East Lansing with that earlier kick, uh, Indiana, Michigan State should stay dry, but still pretty cool with 30s at kickoff. Here are your low temperatures tonight. Boy, this is a switch close to freezing even in the metro zone. This is with mostly clear skies, light winds, so we will be seeing some 20s in spots, but a lot of sub-freezing numbers there in Lenawee County. West zone lows anywhere between 29 in Fenton, 31 in Milford, 29 out in Ann Arbor. Lapeer, one of the cooler spots too tonight as we see those temperatures dip down below freezing in a good chunk of our north zone. Here's your forecast. Otherwise, we will be seeing the skies clear out, the winds calm down, maybe a little bit of patchy fog in some spots too. 52 on the high side tomorrow. And Karen, that's going to be one of our warmer numbers. We will get to 57 Sunday, but it's coming with a lot of clouds and rain. So most of this forecast is at or below average, and it's a huge switch to get used to. It definitely is. Sweater weather for sure. Yep. All right. Thank you, Ben. Mm -hmm. Still